Macca's guides. <laughs> Hey guys, Mac here, Trials Fusion Empire of the Sky DLC. This is the Three Birds, One Stone Achievement Slash Trophy Guide for completing all three challenges in a single run under 15 faults on the level Stratosphere. Special shout out to Carnage and Arcane Insanity, who were the two people who helped me figure this out uh, as I was struggling. Um, for this one, you're going to need to probably be a expert or better rider. Now, I barely am able to get this achievement, and I can platinum most of the extreme tracks in the original game. Um, so yeah, a high level of skill is involved in this achievement, or a high level of patience. Your first room you saw me do is, uh, there's a checkpoint where you cut a wire with your front wheel. Uh, I recommend you don't fault before that. Uh, but once you do that, you can back up, and you'll land into your first laser pit. And once you're in the room, you'll do the fire level, which is pretty easy. I recommend you do it in uh, between one and three faults. Uh, make sure you practice it. Practice does make perfect. And after that, you're just going to want to continue on through the level. And eventually, you will reach this checkpoint right here, where you can trigger the next area, which is the laser level. To do that, you're going to want to go up here, bail, grab that box with Y, and hold on to it. Make sure you keep holding on to it, it'll respawn you and not give you a fault, which is nice. Now if you come up here, back up, and fall here, you can trigger the laser level. Now the laser level isn't too bad, it's all about timing and not actually much about skill at all. Uh, the first one, you're going to want to do that pattern. For the second one, jump onto the wall and land onto that button. Now what you're going to want to do is go up the ramp in front of me, lean forward, and make sure you clear the lasers as far as you can with forward momentum. So as you see, I start accelerating up the ramp very early, um, even before the lasers start coming back in my direction to clear them, catch grip, and you can go up and over really, really fast, or if you're on the slower end, you can stop on that ramp behind me and uh, just wait for the lasers to go back and forth. Now, next up, you're gonna just have to time that, do a backflip onto here, and you should be done the laser section with what I would recommend to be five or less faults, as the gravity area is by far, in my opinion, the hardest and the least reproducible. To get to the gravity area, what you're gonna wanna do is go to the very end of the level, keep progressing here, you'll get shot forward through uh, the air, and you'll jump up and over, you'll see that you're in very, very low gravity. We just passed over the lasers, um, and to get these lasers to trigger, we're gonna have to do another bailout method. Go back to the checkpoint, uh, go forward, bail up and forward into that little structure on the wall which will light you on fire. Keep waiting for the cinematic to end and it'll spawn you back on your bike without giving you an extra fault. Now just back up and fall into this wormhole and you're in the low gravity area. This is all about throttle control and moving your bike very gently back and forth. To do that first one, you're going to want to do a backflip onto here, do a bunny hop, land front wheel first, and then hop over that can. These are all pretty much expert techniques, so if you're a new rider, you might find a lot of these very difficult. Now, this is the second hardest uh, checkpoint, in my opinion. What you need to do is hit that button in front of you, and then lightly feather your gas to get yourself off the wall just enough to land on this platform, and then go here. This is what I would say is the, definitely the hardest checkpoint of the entire challenge. Uh, I do, I think, I think like eight or six of all of my faults on this one checkpoint. And the first two times I did it, I did close to 100 or 150 faults to get it uh, down. So here I almost got it, but didn't quite get it. What you want to do is in a neutral stance, you want to very, very, very lightly throttle your gas and then just feather it a tiny bit extra at the very end of that ramp and make sure you tilt your bike so that your front or back wheel don't touch that uh, barrel. Then it's a small bunny hop. Be very careful with that bunny hop at the end to not hit your head on the roof. And as soon as you come out of that gravity area with less than 15 faults, you will unlock the achievement. Good luck. Practice, practice does make perfect if you're struggling. Um, and hopefully that was helpful to you guys. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Let me know how many faults you were able to do it in. I'd love to hear what you guys were able to do. I'll see you next time. Peace.